The White House Coronavirus Response Coordinator made headlines Sunday. She wanted to alert people who might feel like COVID-19 was less of a problem because they don't live in the city. But I want to be very clear. What we're seeing today is different from March and April. It is extraordinarily widespread. It's into the rural as equal urban areas. And to everybody who lives in a rural area, you are not immune or protected from this virus. To test that in Utah, we first found that the U.S. Census Bureau shows six urban areas in six Utah counties. Cache County in the north, Weber, Davis, Salt Lake, and Utah counties on the Wasatch Front, and Washington County to the south. The rest are rural. So this chart shows the percentage of cases in those urban counties in blue. Cases in rural counties are in brown. Those urban counties hold 85 percent of Utah's population. So let's put a red line at 15 percent, the percentage of people living in rural counties. When the brown columns reach or top that line, that's a week when rural counties saw as many cases or more than their share. Early on, on, the winter resort havens in Summit and Wasatch counties accounted for big spikes, and Navajo outbreaks in San Juan County have also played a role. But it's more widespread now, and as evidence, the White House state report last week put three Utah counties in the red zone, San Juan, Kane, and Garfield counties. Our urban areas were in the yellow zone. In the newsroom, Max Roth, Fox 13 News, Utah.